<laughs> Guy Hamilton Smith wants to be a lawyer so he can help people. I wanted to be an advocate for people that didn't have an advocate. Uh, my original plan was to go you know, to the public defender's office. Those plans are on hold. Hamilton Smith graduated from UK Law in 2011 and works at a Lexington law firm, but not as a lawyer because he hasn't passed the bar and wait until you hear why. I am a sex offender. Child porn. Hamilton Smith says he would spend hours at night looking at all types of porn. He says he downloaded naked pictures of underage girls as young as 11 years old. I convinced myself that I wasn't doing anything wrong, that I wasn't hurting anyone. His girlfriend reported him in 2007 to police. Hamilton Smith says he came home one day, learned he'd be arrested, and almost jumped off the balcony of his Park Plaza apartment. The very sort of taboo nature of it, you know, appealed to something in me. Um, and I mean, it was very, I was very deep in denial. Hamilton Smith pled guilty to a felony charge. Here he is on the sex offender registry. He's thankful for the arrest and went through a 12-step program and therapy. During his own prosecution, Hamilton Smith first became interested in law. But becoming a lawyer is a whole new legal battle. The Bar Association rejected Guy Hamilton Smith because he's on the sex offender registry. Hamilton Smith's attorney Scott White asked the state Supreme Court to consider cases like this on an individual basis and also argued they're preventing Hamilton Smith from reintegrating into society. The state Supreme Court told Hamilton Smith he can apply for the bar exam when he's off the sex offender registry, which can't happen for at least 18 more years. Hamilton Smith asked the court to reconsider. You know, we're not about to win any popularity contests, I know that. But he says it might be worth discussing the pros and cons of the sex offender registry. If in the end of the day, I mean, I never get to take the bar exam, um, you know, I will try to find other ways to be able to, you know, to help others. In Lexington, Aaron Adelson, ABC 36 News.